continue integrating female soldiers into Israel's tanks corps. That's the order from IDF Chief of Staff Aviv Kochavi. This after 15 women completed a pilot program, which wrapped up last year. Two of them became tank commanders, but it hasn't been an easy road. The IDF evaluated female soldiers' ability physiologically and how practically they would be incorporated into tanks. The issue became deprioritized, and the integration hasn't happened, at least not yet or fully, even though two petitions were filed to the Supreme Court by female recruits who want to be tankists. What we are asking is that each soldier will be evaluated by their abilities, not by their gender. I was able to do exactly the same things, so I simply hope to see more women drafted into the armor brigade. The IDF released some conclusions after the pilot program, pointing out certain areas of difficulty, the heavy weight of some of the equipment soldiers need to deal with, minimum height and weight requirements, and whether it was feasible to have men and women in tanks together. Ultimately, the chief of staff, Kochavi, decided tanks would be made up of of only men or only women. Also, that the next program will have double the number of participants. The female combat soldiers will serve on the Egyptian border, but those that petition to the Supreme Court want total equality. If men are being sent to other borders, they feel they should be as well.